and they'll call you a traitor. If you tell those same black people to stop dropping napalm on brown skinned babies in Vietnam, you want to appeal to the conscience of a country like this? The Jews in Germany were nonviolent all the way to the gas ovens. Now you go ask the people in the concentration camps if nonviolent got them their freedom. Now as for me, I'm going to deal with the concentration camps we have here in America. Only here they're called New York City, or Detroit, or Philadelphia, Chicago. You're looking for a conscience, Martin. You better look someplace else. Anybody preaching nonviolence, while you see the enemy out there building gas ovens, you're helping to destroy your own people. When black people refuse to fight back, it not only makes it easy for racists to kill us, it makes it justifiable. You think I contributed to that? Let's just say, any man who wants to kill me, anyone who wants to kill any man, they don't stop and think. Now, what would the good doctor do? They know what you do. Nothing. Which is about what you've accomplished. Don't tell me that. We've accomplished nothing. Now, now people were beaten for nothing. Do you think it's easy for me to sit there and watch my own people being beaten? To risk the lives of my own children? No. Do you think I would risk my own life for nothing? 